Thank you. <clears throat> I feel like I want to start the episode by saying something, but I forgot. Alright, here I go. Let's end this quickly. I actually want to get some writing done today. I don't think I'll be showering. I showered yesterday anyway. Although I guess that ultimately depends on the weather. Ah, yeah, I have my controller plugged in right now, charging. This thing does have a really nice long lifespan. At least it has that going for it. Anyway. Alright, I forgot this game's kinda loud. Alright, nothing left for us to do here. Let me just... Adjust the motions. Okay. I do believe there is a movement attack you can do with Barry to go faster, or maybe I'm thinking of a different game that has a similar thingy. Am I actually thinking of wave dashing right now? Dear me. Yeah, no, that doesn't work. <laughs> Lopside is a strange place. It's the only place... Where when you flip, you look to the back. You look to the left rather than to the right. In this entire game. Since I'm here, may as well see what we can cook up. like it if this healed more. I can heal my full 30 HP, which will eventually become 35. Sooner than one might expect. Cut 
I yield, I'll have more peanuts. I wanna eat something while playing this. prefer more healing over all these damaging items for exploration so uh how is it I'll go store these for now I'll score this. It's way too important for me to just use Will and Nelly. Oh, I don't have any more healing. Well, we'll be fine. Right, unfortunately, we're going to have to backtrack our way into Chapter 3. We can't just select to go back to Chapter 3. Them's the rules. We gotta beat the entire chapter first before we can choose with what part we want to visit. Did you miss us? We didn't. Let's go. Took us a, a, a bit longer than we wanted. Never mind, Barry, you're useless.
I don't remember. Made it. Alright, that's the hard part. Chapter 2 won't take that long. Mostly. I'm just impressed this place has an atmosphere that we can breathe in. And even air particles for the parasol to... we go. Back to the woe zone. Ah, lovely. That's what's up. the spot a suspicious okay well then ain't this convenient I don't know why, but I want to be squeezed into there. Someone squish me in. 
Squeezer. Squeezer. Yeah, okay. What is this thing? It's a space gate, Squirt. These leads from the space bypass to the wall zone. Who is getting us the way forward, space runs? Okay. Forgot I have flip. There's two of them. Another wonderful shape! I feel another compulsion. Must get twisted into there! Tell me twist me in! Sure. Something! Something's missing, Squirt. Definitely, I can't see it. There's only one solution. That's right! Squirts must eat something yummy! Squirt will not move until Squirt eats something good! Yes, I declare, Squirt! Why? Oh, chosen one, what will fulfill the strange alien's desire? Something sweet that starts with Cho and ends with late. This will open the, the way. I was just having something. I was just eating something. Sweet that starts with Cho and ends with late. There it comes a new skull during these sections. Though he may be gone, there's still enemies. And since his sorry ass doesn't want to help us, it's up to us to deal with this bullshit. It's a space convenience store. I wonder why. Have a twinkly day! Welcome to Twinkle Mart! If we're not close, we're open! Wow, I was so lonely since our grand opening! You're our first customer! I think I should have thought about the location more when I bought this place. What you looking for today? Just wrap it up around your eye, Twinkle Shoppers! Ooh. It gets lonely here, so promise to come again, okay? I can't promise that. We can actually see a little bit of Peach's feet <laughs> when we're space swimming. Lovely. Bah. Bah. 
Opa! Uh, is this the way back? So hungry, Squirps can't move. Well, Squirps can move. Blah 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 blah. blah. Click the Joko bar. Squirps is a gourmet. You think I'd be satisfied by something like this? Squad! But you went to all this trouble, Space God, so I don't want to, but. Squatomp. This is. The chocolate and nuts not together, creating a full flavor with a clean finish! It's a sweet chocolate sonata written for lovers. It's pure toko love. Too good. Squirt. Sorry about that. Squirt got carried away. The gate. It's a beard. The goal is nice, cool. That's not makes fun. Yes, that just happened. There, actually. Let me make another save. Did it. And the fuck was that noise? Mario and his friends took the space byway and emerged into the woe zone. Known to some as the space graveyard, it was said to consume all who entered it. Just a little bit longer. We'll be arriving soon, said young Squirps. With his unblinking eyes glimmering, Squirps continued to forge onward. Would Mario and his friends get their hands on the pure heart at long last? Oh boy. Mysterious Mr. L. We're here, Squiggle! This is the Woe Zone! Squirps has finally arrived, Squadly! Squirps is here! Squirps can't wait! Squirps is going to scare your head. Follow Squirps when you can. So remember, Space Grunts, this place is a super complicated maze. You'll get lost before you know it, so pay attention to where you're going, Squirp! Well, Squirps will see you guys later at the spot where the fear heart awaits. And he's gone. I can't believe that creature left us at a time like this. But I must say, I do feel the presence of the fear heart. It's somewhere in this zone. Good to know. The wall zone certainly seems bizarre. I'm sure that your flip ability will come in handy. That it will.
Peyote time, why are you failing me? Whatever. Ah, fuck. I didn't know there was an event thingy I had to use. I'll go there later. What the hell is that? I just use Bowser. Mysterious power makes you jolly. Start the wheel of fun. Yep, this is what the charm does. Oh, really? Worthless. Damn it. Oh, that was a lot of moolah.
Oh, I guess this is a thing. Bah. Tolerated. Thank <laughs> you. 
Ладно. Lovely. If only I'd done that before I died. Alright, here we go. I'm waiting. Square palm, okay? Up. We are hard that you're looking for us just ahead, space guns. Whoops. You've done well. You're a smart kid. Squirple Squee, stop it. Squirps is embarrassed. Wait, whose voice was that, Squall? Squirp! Who are you? Oh, me? Just wanna count blacks more wrongs and minions. The Green Thunder. Mr. L. Mr. L? I don't need you to tell me. It's a cool name. I know it. Don't bother memorizing. Why? Because I'm about to give you a burial at sea. I mean a burial in space. Just because you're in red doesn't mean you're strong. How about you? Right, you can use flip to daze him. Uh, you can use flip to daze enemies here in general. It's just very impractical. <laughs> Uh, we can use Peach for defensive, or I can just go Wa Bowser. <laughs> no, let me. Yeah, he jumps. No. <coughs> Oof, impressive. I guess there's but one thing to do, hmm? Come to me, Metal Bro.
Haha, <laughs> do you like him? That is my dear metal brother. He and I share a spiritual bond, you know. Yes, yes, and his name is Brobon. Enough playing already. Now for pain. Now the real fight begins. The gravitational laws of space allow Brobot's potential to be fully realized. Hey, Mr. Get Spoiled Boy all the time by the guy with red must with the mustache. I'll fall your face. Uh, and we have anyway. We need a smaller hitbox here. Fortunately for you, I am a master of bullet hell games. Oh, nice. Also, there's power-ups for some reason. Oh! No! Uh, that's my first game over. That was awkward. I wasn't paying attention to my health. Anyway, I want to see the other dialogue. I don't think I've ever seen Peach's dialogue, but I have seen Bowser's. Are you alright? Hey. Mr. L? No one's coming to save you this time, dearest princess. How about you? And I like his cream so much. <laughs> hey, Miss Always Kidnap, I'll kidnap your face! What? That's the robot. The super robot is one of Mr. L's creations. Max HP's 255. Defense against fire is 6. Ah, oh, fuck! I didn't know you- I didn't know it was that close. <laughs> I thought I could get a little closer. <laughs> Win! Make no sense. No, you be robot. Oh, I'll let you off the hook for the rest of the day, I suppose. But remember this: when Fortune smiles next, she'll smile right here on Mr. L. Hmm. 
that Mr. L fellow. I feel as though I've met him somewhere before. Dude. He's so obviously Luigi. But since no one cares about him enough, he's always forgotten. Even Mario can't recognize him. What a dick Mario is. Oh, that was awful, Squirp. We have to pull ourselves together, Space Crunch. The fear heart is ahead. Come on, Squinkles. Okay. Mommy, mommy, mommy! Squirts brought them here. Oh, we're finally here. Come on, say hi to Squirps. It's mommy, Squirp. Okay. Yeah, this is Squirps and mommy. The queen of Squirpia. Her name is Squirpina. The 15th. The 14th, I mean. The queen is your mother? So you're... Yes, he's a prince, which explains his personality. Squirp Corogaline Squirpina. That's my full name. Sorry for not telling you. Squirp promised not to tell. It makes Squirps a target. Long ago, Squirps' mother was told that destruction would come to the world. And in order to protect us from this destruction, we needed a pure heart. So mommy hid a pure heart in the wall zone where no one could get to it. And so 1500 years ago, Squirp was put to sleep in a hibernation capsule. Squeep. Squirp was meant to bring the hero here to protect the world, Squirple. Oh, Squirps. The Prince of Squirpia, Squirps has a message from the Queen to deliver. I bestow upon you the pure heart in the hope that you will save the world. Here, take it, Squirp. Ew! Now that Squirps is all relaxed, Squirps feels kind of tired, said Squirps. And with that, Squirps laid down before the statue of his beloved mother. Mother, he said, his voice soft. I did my best, right? Are you proud of me? And slowly, young Squirps closed his eyes. The mission had weighed heavily on his tiny back, and he was proud to fulfill it. Yeah, so guys, huddle up, okay? Look at Mimi, she's in another costume. We're just gonna have a new, quick new minion orientation. His name is Mr. L, and he comes to us from one of our key competitors. Hmm, can't say I'm impressed by the minion quality. No, indeed. No wonder you've been trounced up to now. You're like Junior Minions. Junior, come here and I'll introduce you to Fist Junior and his wee pal Slurpy. Gosh, Mr. L, but didn't you get pretty spanked too? So maybe you're the junior. Spanked to say ho ho. I was scouting him, dear. He will be mine next time. Yes, you shall know the fury of the one and only Mr. L, aka the Green Thunder. But enough about me. I need to head to the repair bay for robot modifications. And later. Two the man in red shall wield formidable powers. One shall stand against you. A man in green shall use the Chaos Heart's power to bring darkness to all. <laughs> so it is written in the Dark Prognosticus. So what you're saying is, the man in green is our minion in training, Mr. L? What? That makes as much sense as a beef and broccoli sandwich. Calm your simple chunks. Make ready, I'm Blacky sending you on a new mission. Ah, now that makes sense. It'll be me honor, Count. I will just swear to you that this hero's got a hot dick with me feet. Chucks away! My, aren't we hot blooded? Well, well. I suppose that's to be admired. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got to be on my way as well. Ciao! So, poor little Mimi doesn't get to be in all the fun. This stinks. 
Yeah, I hate to seem like a whistleblower here, but Funk Chunks may not... Actually, even the Mancho, Mimi, and Mr. L may not be up to this. That hero's gonna collect the pure hearts and come here. I'll come for you. <laughs> All is according to plan. How Black assures you. It's strange. Nobody ever, um, cherished the universe the way you once did. And yet you've been made to destroy it. That's quite enough, Nastasia. If I could... Uh, I... What? If only I could have, you know, been that girl. Things would have been different. She cannot be replaced. You could never hope to do so, Nastasia. Yeah, um, I'm very sorry. That just slipped out. To be sure, she is gone. Gone from all worlds, never to return. What are you thinking? There's no possible way. No one would allow it. If we can't be happy here, we must leave for a place that will accept our love. Ah shit, I had it the other way around, god damn it, I knew it. But Lumia, is there such a place? Think, I can't bear to see you hurt again. If our love has no home, let us spend our lives searching together. So, I beg of you again, Timpani. Marry me. I promise I will make you happy. You just won't give up, won't you? Of all the crazy, stubborn, foolish men. Timpani. Answer me, please. Lumir, I love you. Take me away. Take me to a world where we can be happy. Now we've gotten five pure hearts. This is turning into quite a collection. What did I tell you, huh? You got the king of all evilness on your side. You can't go wrong. Yes, yes. <laughs> That said, we owe Scorps for helping us find this one. We should be grateful. Say, Tippy, something seems different about you lately. You seem a little bit more cheerful. It's a nice change. You think so? Well, ever since you saved me from Fort Francis, I've been feeling really good. I feel like I could just hang around with Mario forever. <laughs> so you're all back. How was it this time, then? Did you find another pure heart in outer space? Yes, we found the fifth pure heart. And this one... <laughs> uh... Huh? What? Tippy! What has happened? All of you, come to my house at once! Hurry now! Very well. Let's all take a breath and gather ourselves here. I'm concerned. Tippy may be unable to maintain her pixel form for much longer. A pixel form? The heck does that mean? Well, you see, Tippy was not always a pixel. I found her in her true form exhausted, cursed to wander through dimensions forever. She was hanging by a thread, barely alive. So I took a desperate measure. Using my ancestor's magic, I transformed her soul into a pixel, and this Tippy was born. I can hardly believe it. So where is Tippy from originally then? She had lost her memory, so I have no idea who she is or where she's from. I can't help thinking she did not come here by chance. Fate connects us, and my intuition in this area is rarely mistaken. The void has grown larger, and these tremors have become more common, I'm afraid. Our situation grows more dire by the moment. The events written in the light prognosticus really foresaw the foretold doom? I will watch over to you. Young heroes, take up your heart. Find the next heart pillar.
No gay. Yeah, it sure is. Go down and check the captain. He's grown larger, I think. Lovely. to read her say that I welcome you! I knew you would come by eventually! Oh! I can see that you would like to ask me where in the world we are! Oh, 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 oh. This place may seem like flip side, but do not be mistaken. You were in flip side, but then you flip flopped sides, friends. You are in flop side! means that I'm not the Merlin you know. I'm the plot side version, a different Merlin entirely. You may call me Nolorem. Well, you see, ours has always been a story of two towns. But the only ones who know about this flip properly are Merlin and I. You seem a bit surprised. Oh, oh, oh. There is a front and a back to all young things. To all things young ones. Now the heart pillar is one floor up. Go and place the pure heart within it. See you. Uh, no, I don't need Peach. I actually do need Mario. Yeah, there he is. Ah, I am surprised you are finding me. I am called Welderberg. I am the Iron Man of the 4G pipes. Have you ever thought, ah, is it, it is taking so long to get around down? Yeah, me too. And so it is my life's work to make my pipes for the transportation. I have inspected here, yeah? I am thinking I can make the pipe needed to flip side. But do you think of this? You are covering cost of materials and labor, yeah? I could make such a pipe. 
You are looking not very rich. How is 300 coins? I don't have any money. Enough money. Right. Money won't be a problem anymore soon enough once we get to the next chapter. So I'll just go... I'll just go pay for it with whatever I have right now. Not so bad day to you. I'll just sell this, honestly. It cost me 50 to get that. <laughs> there must be something I can sell. actually enough. Abu Masha Kalaka. Another great day for Wellabird. Working in the sunshine just feels so good, yeah? This old man is happy. But that is neither in here nor in the dale. I've inspected here, yeah? I'm thinking... Na -na 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 -na. Yes. This is the good thing, yeah? I'm getting started. You are staying out of the way. This pipe is open 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. You are using it whenever, yeah? Wise people are always being more efficient. You made the wise decision. Well, I am going. Hell yeah. And with that, I shall end the chapter here. I shall end the episode here.